before the pandemic, there was very much a hands-on place and it was buzzing and anytime you walk down the hall, you're gonna see some cool project going on. When we moved to remote learning, computing had this challenge of how do you make virtual spaces that are as dynamic as the physical space that we have. We use the Zoom API to pre-create a set of links for each course so that faculty wouldn't have to worry about that. They can just focus on content and teaching and all the other crazy changes going on. We we're playing around with the Zoom API more and saw, well, we, we have some insight into who is in a meeting at any given time. And so what if we display this on our course links page too? Your image shows up when you join one of those meetings and that kind of gave the class a sense of community and activities, it created some opportunities for like the serendipitous interactions that you would have at there in person. What we decided to do was just expand our, our course links page and recreate an iconic physical space in there and that's the couch lab. So the couch lab is like a maker space. You'd see classes going on there and also students needing to do group work there all the time. It's a really cool space in there. Instead of just a list of Zoom meetings now, what we did was we made a little SVG map and we overlaid that onto the map so that each table links to a different Zoom meeting and it's all based on the Zoom API. It's a free form space, so we're seeing like labs come in to use it for lunch or uh, staff having a coffee chat with each other. We're getting a little bit of that sense of buzz and fun and creativity and playfulness that everyone was really missing. And it's all built on Zoom.